Hey guys, it's your boy Josh Boy, aka Boy from Ipanema, here for I Love to Create dot com. Well, hello there. So I just got home from vacation. If you can't tell, I'm pretty brown. I spent Memorial Weekend at the beach, and one thing I really noticed is that a lot of guys were rocking those cool braided leather bracelets. And I thought to myself, I need one of those. Not because I need it, but I just really want one. So I hit up my local trendy store, and I noticed that the prices were pretty crazy. So I decided that I could make it myself. I headed over to my local craft store and got a few supplies, and just like that, I made myself a cool leather bracelet. I'm gonna show you how you can make your own leather bracelet. Super simple, super easy, and perfect for summer. Keep watching to see more. You'll need some leather cord. I soaked mine in water for about an hour to make it easier to work with. Some scissors. Some tulip slip dimensional paints. Tape. And some thick string. This is some tie-dyed shirt yarn that I made with Jader Bomb. I'll put the link for the tutorial in the description. Now measure around your wrist and give yourself a few inches for safety. Then cut about 5 or 6 cords depending on how chunky you want your bracelet. This braid I'm doing a fishtail flat. To achieve this, separate the cords into two sections. Then take a cord from one side and cross it over to the other side. Then take a cord from the other side and cross it to the next side. Repeat this process all the way down. So once you're done, it should look something like this. Ta-da! I'll take a small piece of your string and tie off the end. You can even use a bit of glue if you're nervous that the tie won't hold. Next, make a loop on the other side and tie it off. This will be how you tie your bracelet onto your wrist. Secure your loop, and then trim off the excess pieces. And now you're ready to design. I'm using my tulip slick dimensional paints to add dots and dashes to mimic the look of beads on my bracelet. Let your paint dry. You may want to give it some extra time because you did soak the leather, which will make your drying time just a slightly longer. And now you're ready to rock your bracelets to the beach and beyond. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. And most importantly, subscribe to see even more awesome videos. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Tumblr, Vine, YouTube, and Twitter, at Boy From Ipanema. Stay crafty, my friends. Bye.